Hey guys, it's just amazing the launch cadence that we're seeing from SpaceX. And I don't often do videos covering their launches, but I wanted to direct your attention to this past Saturday's launch. In fact, that was Orbital Launch 46 just for the year 2022. So let that sink in. Look at this video of SpaceX's Intel Sat launch from Saturday. It had some of the best visuals of any recent launch that we've seen. First of all, it was a sunset launch on a perfectly clear night. Now behind me at the T plus 459 mark of the launch, this spectacular footage is from the drone ship, a shortfall of Gravitas. And this is shortly after Miko and stage separation. It captures not only the October pumpkin sunset, but the iconic space jellyfish created by the second stage plume as it propels directly overhead. You can also see the remnants of the wispy vapor trail left by the first stage booster perfectly lined up with the drone ship. And speaking of perfectly lined up, look at these spectacular shots taken by my friend Matt Cutshall of the Falcon 9 transiting a full moon. Matt and a gaggle of photographers have been waiting three years for this shot. They needed three things to work perfectly, a launch at sunset with the full moon and perfect weather. They got that opportunity when the previous two launch attempts were scrubs for technical reasons, pushing the launch day to a full moon. That bad luck was their good luck, and they used software developed by Declan Murphy of Fight Club IO to know when and where to stand to make these incredible shots. So yeah, going up on my wall for sure. In fact, the weather was so cooperative that even 150 miles away, the Falcon could be seen rising over Sarasota, Florida. So thank you to Scott Walter for sending me this clip since I wasn't there on the ground. Lost amongst the scenery is the fact that this was the 14th time this booster was successfully launched and landed and look at that sunset. So yeah, a successful Falcon 9 launch is no big deal, but we have to appreciate all of the time that photographers spend out there to get these incredible shots, all of the work that SpaceX has done to make this clockwork-like launch schedule an absolute reality. It's just amazing and I can't wait to see more of these launches in person. In fact, I am going to do my best to get out to the Falcon Heavy launch at the end of the month, so really looking forward to that, but just remarkable and yep, I'm a rocket nerd. <laughs> well, I hope that you guys liked this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to Ellie in Space if you haven't already. The support means a lot and I have a lot of really interesting things planned over the next few weeks. I can't wait to share it all with you. I'll see you in the next video.